Hey guys, Jimmy of Vegas here, and today we are taking a look at an asset on the Unity Asset Store called Mini Legion Footman. Now, what initially attracted me to this is actually this guy here on the left. Now, I always look for different types of assets that can be used in different types of games, and this one looks more like it's designed for kind of mobile gaming. And I can see what this is really aiming for. If we take a quick look through some of the images that it's got, you can see. You know, you could see this as a bit of a, a mobile game. And obviously, you can kind of use these and customize them yourself. So let's take a look at the actual package. Now, it comes with, in the scene view, it always comes with, a de I love demo scenes. You guys know I love demo scenes. It comes with two of these guys right here. And the easiest way that I can describe these is they basically come with uh, one with an actual material and one uh, that theoretically just adds the emission and they do kind of appear different and although it's the same actual theoretical model you, there's some variation right there so quality wise i think it's actually quite nice i mean you just have to take a look at this guy here and if we for example let's take a look at his materials uh, we can see here that yeah it's got a whole material and you can customize this quite nicely depending if you're how metallic you want it to look uh, it is well designed, it's very well built, and like I said, it does appear aimed for mobile devices, but that doesn't necessarily mean you can only use it for mobile devices. So I would say quality-wise, it's quite well done. Now, the only thing I do have uh, a little bit, not really a problem, as it were, if we go to the animation itself uh, and go to animations, uh, if we quickly press play and have a look at the actual scene it's in if Unity decides it's actually going to do something. Don't just hate it when you do press play and just does nothing. So the animations don't uh, play straight off the bat. Uh, oh, hang on, they did then. They did, didn't they? There they go. When I tried it before, it didn't work. Forget what I just said then. So obviously the animations are there. So if we go to the animator, we can see there they do actually work. So obviously, if we press play, we can see the different animations they go through. So this is obviously going to be very useful in that sense because they do have animations. You can do what you want with those animations. Uh, quantity, you get what you see here. There's no real sense of massive amounts of things here. You get the demo scene, you get the two uh, models, although, like I say, theoretically, it's the same model, just uh, reskinned. Um, yeah, add a bit of maybe post-processing to make it look however you would want it to be. Uh, let's quickly press play and just see how the animations look when they go through the cycle. Um, yeah, so versatility, obviously you can change things. You don't have to have it quite so shiny. You don't have to have them blue. You can change that. You can do what you need to. Uh, extras wise, there's no real extras here um, other than the animations maybe. Could you class them as extras? Not sure. Either way, the animations clearly are very fluid and they look really, really nice. I'm actually more impressed with this now than what I was when I first tried the asset. So yeah, that's good. So with usefulness, yep, I can see how this would be useful in many types of games. If you're going for that style of game, the cuteness factor maybe or something like that, then yeah, they're going to be really, really useful. Price, uh, as I make this review, it is indeed free on the asset store, but prices change all the time so just keep that in mind um size is five megabytes which is actually really really good so that's very low on size you don't want to take up too much space especially if you're going for mobile gaming yeah so size wise i think that's great it's, but even with a slow connection that's not going to take you too long to use so as you guys know uh, i don't uh, rate assets i either recommend them or i don't and Yes, I'd recommend this asset, but obviously I wouldn't recommend it if you're trying to design or rather go for a, a, the triple A kind of feel. Uh, it is only the free package and this creator obviously has a lot more. So you're going to get a lot more for your money if you do end up paying. But obviously that is something that you would have to figure out for yourself if it is worth paying. But other than that, this free one definitely is worth it, even just maybe to prototype something in your game. So guys, what do you think of this asset? Do you like it? Have you used it? If you have, let me know in the comments below. 
If you've got anything on the asset store yourself you'd like me to take a look at and review in one of these fancy little videos, please let me know in the comments as well and link me to your asset. I'd love to take a look. Don't forget, click subscribe, click on the bell icon as well. And you can stay up to date with everything I have on video game development on my channel. And guys, thank you very much for watching.